Sydney from Australia and Korea University. They're warming up right now down on the floor. And uh, yeah, hope you're having a uh, good weekend. It's Sunday here in uh, Tokyo and uh, just about 10.52 in the morning, waiting for 11 o'clock tip-off time. Four games total today, and uh, we'll have our special guest for the very last finals uh, game. Once again, the assistant coach of the Nagayo, Nagoya Diamond Dolphins, Ken Hamanaka, who joined us for the last two games last night uh, with myself and also my uh, partner, Matthew. And uh, he's a really, really wonderful guy, great assistant coach, knows the game, uh, knows what the coaches are talking about, you know, in their timeouts, and uh, gave us some good insights on the teams yesterday. So look forward to that as well. That'll be the final. NCCU versus Hakuo, game four, uh, later on tonight. So now let's uh, look at the rosters for today. We're going to start with Sydney, and uh, we're going to, uh, that's up on the screen now, so uh, if you'll take a look. And um, yeah, yesterday Sydney played some really, really good basketball, and there are some uh, players to look out for. Uh, playmaker, number seven, Mikey Yoon, the point guard. Also uh, yesterday, Robbie Moore played a very, very tight and good game. Their uh, shooting guard, number 11, Robbie Moore. And then, of course, uh, the main player for the, for the team, Matthew Washa. And uh, he's at 190 centimeters, the point guard, and he's the playmaker as well. Uh, Campbell Green, the center, played a great game as well. And uh, we're going to uh, go to a little VTR on Campbell's game yesterday. So, uh, yeah, check out. Campbell's work on the screen. Campbell Green, the center, number 21. Making it, dropping it from outside, getting the rebounds, and also working it under the basket, like right here. Gets his own rebounds, puts it back up for a point. So we're showing some highlights from the work by Campbell Green, uh, freshman center for Sydney. And Sydney team warming up right now. There you see uh, Campbell warming up, put some shots up. Had a chance to say hi to him yesterday. Nice guy, of course. And then uh, now let's go to the uh, Korea side. Uh, and uh, we're going to look at first Korea's roster. Some of the key players will be number nine, uh, Kim Taehyun. Number 13, Pak Junyeon. And number 18, Lee Dongin. And uh, those will be some of the key players we're going to watch out for. Um, I'm, I'm sure uh, the, teams, the teams are all very well-rounded. So it's not just the key players, but of course, uh, it's a team sport. So you need everybody to con contribute. And we've had some very, very tight matches as well. So uh, and we're going to uh, go to some VTR, I think, on one of the uh, key players for Korea. And we'll see uh, what kind of uh, game we can expect from them today. So once again, WBS 2023. And now uh, highlights for number 18, Lee Dungan. And uh, we're going to have some highlights for him. Freshman, 198 centimeters. And uh, yep, get ready to uh, give you some BTR on some of his action. Here we go. So we'll definitely keep an eye on him today. Takes the feed and pops in the three-pointer from the perimeter. We've been uh, seeing some uh, hot, hot hands pumping in some three-pointers throughout the tournament. And now we have him working into the paint. Does a quick 360 and bops it in for a layup. So that's number 18, Lee Dongin, who uh, we're going to be uh, keeping an eye out uh, today throughout the game. Approaching tip-off time. Pretty soon, uh, we'll be giving you uh, who the head coaches are, the rosters, give you a rundown, and get you all set up for the game starting in just a few minutes. And once again, we are at the Yoyogi National Gymnasium number two all day. Uh, the last uh, tip-off will be around 6 o'clock. So if you're in the Tokyo area and want to see some exciting college basketball, uh, come on down and see us. We'd love to have you here. And just for your information, Toko, we are facing some inclement weather. Uh, there is a typhoon headed to western Japan. Uh, Number five, Kim Deung. Six, Pak Junwan. Number seven, Yu Minsu. Number nine, Kim Taehyun. And number 18, Lee Dongyun. 
And we just saw some highlights from Lee, 198 centimeters, a freshman from Korea University. Now we are approaching time while they're introducing the referees, and we are approaching tip-off time. And we've got the uh, Korea team lined up for their beauty shot for TV and for the audience. Nice uh, little greeting performance from Team Korea. And the excitement level is coming up already. The final day of the three-day tournament. And this will decide the seventh and eighth place teams as the uh, teams come onto the court for the tip-off. Team Sydney playing, uh, paying their respects to the referees. And now the players are greeting each other, showing sportsmanship, bowing to the referees. And now we're getting ready for tip-off time. Here we go. WUBS 2023 Shibuya Tokyo Japan. Game number one, final day, and we're off to a start. Korea gets the ball, working the perimeter. Takes a three-point shot, hits the rim, bounces off. Korea gets the rebound. Drives in, no go there. Works it back out to the perimeter. Trying to find an open man. Screen into the lane. Open man in the three-point shot, top of the key. Bounces off the rim. Korea still gets the rebound. They've been getting some lucky re uh, bounces off the rebound, so uh, they've had three possessions in a row. Trying to drive in, no go there by Sydney. Three point shot, pops in. 3 0 Korea in the early moments of game number one today. And Sydney gets the ball knocked out of his hand. First foul for Korea. Sydney works it in, gets it to Mikey Young. Mikey Young was also the, the, the big uh, playmaker yesterday. Mitch Smith takes the spill. And they lose possession of the ball. Ball goes to Korea. They'll work it in. Sydney showing some early pressure down court. We're already into a press. Korea quickly brings it down court. Once again, uh, working the perimeter, perimeter to start as they uh, kind of check out each other's uh, defenses. Another three-point shot, and it's good. Hot hand already for Korea. And made that three-pointer. Sydney now trying to work it into the paint. Back out to Waka in the perimeter, who drives in, puts it up, in and out. Kind of forced the shot. Korea now bring it back down. Right now we're seeing a man-to-man uh, -man defense by Sydney. Drive in, misses the shot. Australia gets the Sydney gets the rebound, working it in, drives in, missed the layup. So we've been seeing a lot of this throughout the tournament. Uh, the first quarter, the teams are feeling each other out, a lot of forced shots. Seeing who's able to drive in, seeing who's able to uh, pop some three-pointers early on. Drive in to the center, to the paint, misses the layup. So Korea is trying to break the uh, Sydney defense and trying to drive in for some shots under the basket. Yeah. 
We have a substitution, number six, Joseph Payne coming in for Sydney. Korea ball underneath the basket. Working inbound, finds an open man who is fouled. And that was Pat Moving who was uh, fouled. Timeout. Sydney. So early on, 7.20 left in the first quarter. It's Korea 6, Sydney 0. And already a couple of uh, three-pointers popped in by Korea. up for uh, the timeout and as Korea comes back onto the court. And now we have a uh, three shot foul. 720 left in the first quarter. First shot is good making it seven zip. Second shot. Awesome. And that's Kim Tayen taking the foul shots. Last shot. Made the first, missed the second, and oh, in and out. Still 7 0, Korea. Sydney needs to get going and get some points on the board just to get started. Cross court pass to Mikey Yoon. Inside. And finally, they get two points from the center, Campbell Green. 7 2 Korea, seven minutes left in the first quarter. So Sydney now can settle down. They've got some points on the board. That always helps to get the team going. Working at top of the uh, three point perimeter. And nice pass inside. That's number seven. Yu Minsu who drives him for the layup. 9-2 Korea. And uh, Sydney passes off to Joshua Payne number six who forces it up in the paint for two points, 9-4. And Korea brings it down. Pat Jongwon passes it off to an open man for a nice three-pointer. And that looked like Kim Tan with another three pointer there for Korea. And Sydney will inbound with 606 left in the first quarter. And that's what. Watch out with the ball, trying to work off the screen. Works it into the center, who loses the ball. Watch it get, gets it back, out to the perimeter. Joshua Payne drives in, gets fouled. No foul, uh, shot clock runs out. Ball changes position, Korea will inbound. No pressure um, at this point, defense by Sydney. Korea brings it down. Oh. 
open for a three-point shot, and he drops it for three for Korea. 15-4, already an 11-point lead. Five minutes and 25 left in the first quarter. Korea putting some pressure on Sydney as they bring it down. One thing that's working for Sydney is feeding it into Campbell Green in the center underneath. That's 15 to 6 now. Korea passes it around. Kim Doon, uh, one of the, the uh, playmakers. Open 12 footer, misses. Sydney brings it back down quickly. Open in the perimeter. Uh, baseline three point shot. And that was Robbie Moore, number 11, the shooting guard for Sydney. Found himself open in the baseline, three points. Korea finds a man underneath, and he pops in the layup. Sydney brings it down quickly, open on the baseline for another three pointer, number 11, Robbie Moore. So Sydney coming back with a couple of three-pointers to cut down the lead. 17-12, Korea over Sydney with four minutes left in the first quarter. Korea once again working it in. Oh! Pac Junyeon makes the three-pointer for Korea, 20-12. And number 11, Robbie Moore tries to drive in, and he's fouled. <laughs> Foul was by Pak Jeonwon, number six for Korea. Two-shot foul. First shot good. Korea 20, Sydney 13. One shot. Final shot. And it's good. Still a six point lead by Korea. 348 left in the first quarter. Korea works it down court. And it looks like Sydney now on a 3 2 defensive zone defense. Korea works it to the baseline. Back out to the top of the key. Nice. Oh, that was a nice pass into the paint. And he's fouled. Found on number 12, Matthew Washa. And that's a, a two shot foul coming up. Kim Doan, number five, was fouled on the play. Second shot coming up. Kim Doan, the guard for the team, and he makes it, making it 22. Korea, Sydney, 14. 326 left in the first quarter, and we have a uh, substitution for Sydney. Mike Young back in the game. He's the other playmaker for uh, the team along with uh, Wacha. And they work the ball through Robbie Moore at the top of the key. And Joshua Payne is fouled as he tries to drive in. Fouled by number 18, Lee Donu. Two shot foul. Number six, Joshua Payne, the shooting guard, makes the first one. Korea still has a seven point lead, 318 left in the first quarter. Second shot, and it's good. Brings the lead back down to six points, Korea over S Sydney. And Korea throws the ball away, Sydney gets it back. Trying to bring it back quickly, but Korea is back for defense. Nice drive in, nice pass. That's Mitch Smith driving in for a layup, finding an open lane down in the paint. And now we have a uh, Korea timeout as uh, Sydney is uh, playing a little catch up. 22-18 with three minutes left in the first quarter. Right now, 
Wow, number nine, Kim Tan is has the hot hand uh, with ten points, and then number six, Pak Jung has uh, six points, and uh, those are the two uh, leading scorers for Korea, Pak Jung won. And for Sydney, uh, Moore with eight points. He's got the hot hand to start. And that's uh, Robbie Moore, the shooting guard for Sydney. And then uh, Josh Payne is uh, next with four. <clears throat> and also uh, Campbell Green, the center, has four for Sydney as well. So uh, back to the game. 3.05 left in the first quarter. Korea 22, Sydney 18. So much too early to uh, really gauge what's, uh, which way it's going to go. Uh, but right now, uh, Korea kind of has the hot hand with uh, well, their uh, three-pointers being so successful. Working in, uh, working around the perimeter, trying to find an open lane or an open man. Gets the screen, works it in. Finds an open man underneath, off the rim. Had a layup. Goes out of bounds, Korea gets the ball back. Their center, Yang Jun, number 11, had a chance for an easy layup, but it Kind of rolled around the rim, didn't quite drop in. Korea works it in to Young Jun, the center. Passes it off. Long three shot attempt, misses. Mikey Young feeds it to Josh Payne, who followed him in the uh, fast break and for an easy layup. 22-20 now, two-point differential. And Korea with another three-point attempt off the rim. Giving Sydney a chance to catch up, uh, missing layups and missing three-pointers. Uh, three and now Sydney working in the uh, perimeter. Mikey Young has the ball, getting some pressure. And he's fouled as he tries to drive in. And that's a foul by Pak Jonwan, the guard for Korea. And we have a uh, two-shot foul coming up. First one bounces out. Mike Yoon taking the foul shot. And he misses the second shot. Korea now works it down. Sydney's getting back quickly for their 3-2 uh, zone defense. Korea is finding uh, an open lane in the paint, but they're not able to uh, produce out of that. Long shot by their center. Yang Jun bounces off the rim. So Korea needs to get some production, steals the ball, drives it down, one on one, layup, good. And that was Pak Jun Won with a, the uh, fast break down. Sydney still uh, has the ball, missed shot underneath, drives in for a missed layup. Both teams now trying, starting to find a lane uh, in the paint. Foul committed midcourt. Number seven, Mikey Yoon uh, with a second foul. Substitutions for Sydney. Michael Wacha is back in the game, and also Campbell Green is back in the game, the center. 24-20. Korea with the four-point lead, 20, 41 seconds left in the first quarter. 
And now Korea brings it down. Sydney has its own defense, 3 2 defense. And the shot is off the rim. Sydney now brings it down court quickly. We've seen more fast breaks from Sydney, and attempted layup is fouled. Uh, is blocked. Joshua Payne is blocked. Korea gets it down fast, has a man underneath, and he's fouled underneath by 21, the center Campbell Green. Sixteen point seven left in the first quarter. We have a substitution for Sydney. Taking the foul shot will be number eleven, the center, Yan Jun. First shot. Shot is good, giving Korea a five point lead with sixteen point seven left in the first quarter. Second shot. And he makes the second shot, giving Korea a six-point lead with 16 seconds left in the first quarter. Sydney now has the ball and is working it down court. A little bit of pressure now mid-court from, uh, from Korea. Now they're backing off. 3-2 defense, zone defense. Forced a uh, three-shot, three-point shot. Goes behind the backboard. Shot clock out of time. And that's it for the first quarter. Korea 26, Sydney 20. So both teams missing a lot of shots, still getting warmed up, just getting started with the first quarter. Um, right now we're in the first game of the day, the finals day today. And now uh, let's look at some uh, points from the uh, first quarter. Joshua Payne with six. Robert Moore with eight, and Campbell Green. And ball goes out of bounds. Korea gets position. And their center brings it in, passes it to the guard. Pak Jeonwan, working the perimeter. Finds an open man inside, passes to the center who's open, but misses the layup. Had a little pressure underneath. Wide open for a three-point shot. Top of the key, misses. Korea gets the rebound. Korea is, are getting a lot of rebounds off of the uh, missed shots. Once again, Korea gets the rebound. Some cases, the ball's taking a lucky bounce. They open the lane, drives in, makes it from right about the uh, foul line. That uh, looked to be number six, Pac one. Sydney now working the perimeter, trying to find a man open inside. And to get it to do the center, Campbell Green, who makes it with a nice hook shot. Ten footer. Korea 28, Sydney 22 now. 8.23 left in the half. Korea now has the ball, working the perimeter. Drives in, finds an open man on the baseline, puts it up for a three-pointer. And that was Pak Jonhyun with the three-pointer, the forward for Korea, number 13. 31-21 Korea. And there's a baseline three-pointer from Sydney that misses. Korea gets the rebound. Substitution, Sydney. Robbie Moore comes back in. Alice Sidhu comes in for Sydney. 7.49 left in the first quarter. 31 Korea, 22 Sydney. Nine point lead by Korea, but still a lot of basketball to be played. So Korea's trying to work it back in. They sit up inside, break outside. Open man on the baseline, misses the three-pointer. And there's a foul. And that's Kim Doan with the foul. Foul on Robbie Moore. 
And it's a change of position foul. Now Korea showing some pressure. Sydney trying to bring it down court quickly. And now at half court. Mike Yoon trying to uh, find the open man. Tries to get it into Campbell Green the center. Misses the pass. Korea brings it down quickly. Finds a, a beautiful inside pass, but misses the layup. Korea gets the ball back. Gets settled down, work the perimeter again. Eight on the shot clock. And Sydney pushes the ball out of bounds, off the bounce, pa bounce pass. Six seconds left on the shot clock for Korea. And they set up for the uh, inbound play. A couple of screens, man gets open. Feeds it inside for a two-point layup. And that was uh, Youngjin, number 11, with a uh, two-point layup. Sydney under a lot of pressure with 6.44 left in the first half. And Josh Payne bounces his off his leg, but is fouled by Korea. Foul was by Kim Taehyung, number nine, the forward for Korea. But he could have left Josh alone, who bounced it off his leg. Sydney Ball inbounds underneath. Finds it to Campbell Green, gets it out to Josh Payne, number six, for a three point attempt off the rim. Sydney gets the rebound once again, and this time, three point shot once again fails by Robbie Moore, a shot attempt. Josh Payne drives in, but he's fouled by Korea. And that's Pak Jung-won with a foul, fourth foul uh, for the guard for Korea. And Korea makes a substitution. And Sydney inbounds it. Sydney now trying to uh, find a man inside more, and there's a layup. Nice drive in. And that was number 14, Mitch Smith, with a nice drive in for a layup. 33 Korea, Sydney 24. Uh, still a nine point differential with six minutes left in the first quarter. Korea working the top of the key, drives in, finds an open man back in the perimeter. And Korea also trying to uh, drive it in. Successful two point layup by Kim Doan, number five. Sydney with a nice hook by Robbie Moore for two points. The pace is definitely picking up as we draw to a close. Five minutes left in the first half. Korea now working it down. Sydney giving a little bit of pressure at half court. Oh, nice bounce pass inside. And once again, that was Yang Jun finding an open lane inside for a two-point layup. 37 Korea, Sydney 26. Five minutes left in the, in the half. And he tries to bounce it inside, gets stolen, and he steals it back, but misses the... Uh, Oh, nice tap in by Campbell Green, the center for Sydney, who uh, taps it in off a rebound. And now Korea works it back in. 3 2 zone defense by Sydney. Bounce passes inside. Throws it cross court to the other side. Two shot. Oh, nice bank shot on a 20-footer. Sydney now drives in. Open man in the baseline. Perimeter attempted three-pointer three fails. Uh, bounces off the rib. And we have a foul on Korea. And that's number five, Kim Doan, committing the foul. And we have substitutions on both T 
teams, and that was the uh, third foul for Kim Dong in of Korea. Sydney inbounds, Josh Payne trying to find uh, open man off the break. Robbie Moore tries to work it in, Korea steals it. Fast, uh, fast break and lays it in. And that was Pak Mubing of Korea who lays it up. Perimeter shot misses by Moore. Korea gets the rebound, but is blocked. Korea brings it back down quickly. But Sydney slows it down. 342 left in the half. 41-28, Korea in the lead, 13 points. And we have a foul. And that's a foul by Henry Anderson away from the ball. And now we have a time, Korea. Timeout, Korea. Picking up the pace definitely, but Korea with a comfortable lead, 41 points uh, to Sydney's 28 with 3.39 left in the first half. Tries to go for a fancy behind the back pass. That goes out of bounds. Ball goes back to Sydney. Could have done a straight pass. That might have worked better for a two-point layup. Sydney now brings it down court. Three minutes left in the first quarter. Sydney trying to work off the screens and get an open man. And that was Yoon with a fourth shot. Sydney gets the ball back. Moore attempts a three-pointer that's off the rim and there's a foul. And that's Mitch Smith with a second foul. And we have a, a player from Korea down. But it looks like he'll be okay. So not a shooting foul, and Korea will inbound. And he brings it in to number six, Pak Jeonwon. Working the ball in quickly. Sydney gets back and sets up quickly for defense. 3-2 zone. Sydney giving a little bit of pressure. Not letting him drive in, but he commits the foul. And that was Henry Anderson, number 20, committing the foul. Second foul. Two twenty-three left in the half. Still a third, thirteen-point lead by Korea. Works it inside. Number eleven, Yang Jun, trying to drive in for a layup. Taps it, tries to taps it, tries to tap it back in, but it misses. Oh, and Korea bounces it off a of Sydney player and gets the uh, out of bounds. Bounce it off the leg of Mitch Smith. And now Korea will inbound it underneath. Substitution Sydney. Number six, Josh Payne comes back into the game. He's their shooting guard, having a good game so far. Korea inbounds. And we have traveling. So, Sydney are now at half court. See if they can do a little catch up with 150 left in the first half. Mike Yoon trying to find an open man, gets it inside, and bounces off the rim. That was a shot attempt by Mitch Smith underneath. Korea brings it back down, drives it in, passes it off to the perimeter for an open man, and it's a three-pointer, Korea! And that was number 23, Kim Minkyu is in the game.
44 Korea Sydney 30 with 105 left in the first half. So Korea is not letting Sydney catch up. Once again, works it inside, but loses the ball to Sydney. Works it quickly down. Michael Jung get, gives it to Joshua Payne, who tries to drive in. Makes the point as he's fouled. And almost a miracle that shot went in as he just throws it up as it's fallen out. Foul by number nine, Kim Taehyun. So the uh, prayer shot goes in, he gets one shot. And it's good. 44 Korea, Sydney 33, cutting the lead to 11 points with 46 seconds left in the half. Korea now working it down, getting half court pressure. And he's fouled by number seven, Mikey Yoon, who's trying to put pressure on Korea player. 40 seconds left, second quarter. Korea 44, Sydney 33. And as Korea works it down court. Fourteen left in the shot clock. Twenty-eight in game clock. Korea tries to work it in, tries to pass it inside, but it's intercepted by Joshua Payne underneath. So now Sydney sets up for the final shot. They'd love to see a three to uh, break out of the first half. And it looks like Josh Payne whackers open. Josh Payne puts it up and falls short, but. Sydney gets the rebound and pops it in for two points. And that was Mitch Smith underneath who gets the final two pointer. Korea 44, Sydney 35. And that's it for the uh, first half. So a lot of back and forth, but Korea with kind of a comfortable lead. Nine points, 44, Sydney 35. Game one today, the finals. Number six, and that's Pak Jonwan. Leaders for Sydney. And that's uh, 10 points, and that's for number 11, Robbie Moore. Nine points for Joshua Payne, number six, and their center, Campbell Green. What are the uh, players to watch out for in the Sydney team? And Campbell Green's got eight points for the first half. So now we're getting ready to uh, tip off into the second half. Third quarter coming up. Exciting college basketball, WUBS 2023. And here we go, Korea inbounds. We'll see if uh, we get a different look on the uh, each team's defenses. They both seem very effective. Finds a man inside who drives in, misses the layup. Works it back out to the perimeter. Feeds it back inside. And out of bounds. Still career ball. Korea takes the uh, shot from the perimeter, gets the rebound, another three-point attempt, top of the key. Tips the rebound into, uh, back to Korea's. And now Pack is uh, trying to find an open man, but bad pass, Sydney gets the ball. And now Sydney brings it down court. That's Mikey Yoon, passes it off to Joshua Payne. Finds Mikey Young inside, and there's a foul. That's Pak Jonyon, number 13, with the foul. And Sydney will inbound underneath the basket. Feeds it. Sydney's kind of forcing the passes right now. Three-point attempt, misses. And Korea with the rebound, coming down fast. Sydney has time to set up. Open man on the perimeter for a three-point shot. It's good! Oh. 
And that was Kim Doan with a three-pointer for Korea. Sydney now working in the perimeter, feeds it in to Campbell underneath. He's not open, he's uh, heavily defended. And he's fouled as it goes in. Matthew Waka finally gets some production from him. He's been kind of quiet the last couple of games. Mikey Young doing a lot of the game playing duties. And Wacha gets two off the shot and is fouled for an additional foul shot, one shot. Korea 47, Sydney 37. Shot misses, Korea gets the rebound. 47-37, 10 point deficit. Korea in the lead, 822 left in the third quarter. And Korea works it around the perimeter. Trying to find an open man off the screen. Mary Lana, and back Mary to the perimeter for a three-point shot. Just... Two-point shot. 49-37, Korea. And Campbell's getting double, uh, double team, a lot of pressure. Still Sydney ball. Robbie Moore will inbound it. So Korea is really keen on uh, Sydney's center, Campbell Green. Korea once again knocks the ball out of bound. Sydney will bring it inbound underneath. Mikey Hume inbounding. Passes it out to Wacha. Nope, that's Joshua Payne, sorry. Off the rim on a long three point shot. And Korea brings it down. And still working the perimeter, trying to find an open man or an open lane. Passes it to the baseline and finds a man inside. Double fakes and he gets the shot. That's Yang Jun. Sydney getting ready for a substitution. And there's a foul. And that's a foul on number nine, Kim Tehu. And Robbie Moore inbounds. And Sydney works the ball around the perimeter. They'd like to catch up with a few more points, but loses the ball in the pass. Quick break by Korea. Sydney gets back in time. Korea loses the ball. Sydney breaches that quickly, but there's a block. Had a chance for an easy layup, but is blocked by Korea. Around the perimeter, drives in for a layup, and it falls in. And that was Pat Mubin. And Joshua Payne works the top of the key, trying to find an open man, passes it to Robbie Moore, and there's a foul. Substitution Korea. And Kim Minkyu comes in for Korea number 23. And it's in the inbounds. A lot of pressure by Korea on defense. Korea tries to open the lane, passes out to an open man in the perimeter. Misses the shot and there's a foul on the play. And there's a foul on Henry Anderson, number 20 of Sydney. 
ball goes to Korea. A lot of pressure by Sydney at half court. Korea now setting up for a play, working some screens. And takes a 12-footer, banks it in for two points. And that was Kim Doon for Korea. 18-point lead by Korea, 55-37. 5.22 left in the third quarter as Korea gets ready for another substitution. Sydney working the perimeter, trying to work it in. Mikey Young trying to look for an open man. Passes off to the perimeter who drives in, and that's Robbie Moore, misses the layup. Kind of forced the shot. Korea coming down fast underneath, is open, and pops it in. Yang Jun for Korea, two points. 20-point lead by Korea now, 453 left in the third quarter. And Sydney takes a three-point shot. Robbie Moore from the uh, perimeter misses. And we have a foul, and Sydney is getting ready to substitute two players. And that's the fourth foul for number 20, Henry Anderson. Korea now inbounds, bringing it down half court. Sydney not putting pressure on at half court right now. Korea is moving the ball very well. And they're also driving in. Oh, and mishandled ball. Out of bounds, Sydney ball. in the inbounds, and Mikey Young brings it down. Mikey Young. And he drives it in, passes out to the perimeter. Joshua Payne gets it in and puts it up for a two-pointer. Josh Payne, one of the leading scorers for Sydney. 57 Korea, 39 Sydney, four minutes left in the third quarter. And Korea once again opening it up the lane. Looking for somebody to uh, drive in or work off the screen. Fakes a three-pointer, goes in for a two, and it's good. And that was Pak Junwan, number six, making the two-pointer. 20-point lead for Korea. Three minutes left in the third quarter. Goes up for a layup. He's fouled, but misses the layup. Foul by Pak Junyeon, number 13. Two shot foul. Johnny Woodcock will be taking the foul shots. And there's a uh, substitution by Sydney. Uh, number three, Kieran Siva comes in. Alexander Sidhu, I'm sorry, number eight comes in. Foul shot, no good. Second shot coming up. Second and final foul shot. Hits the rim, bounces off. No good. 20 point lead by Korea with 3.30 left in the third quarter. They're pulling away. Sydney is not able to do any catch up at this point, missing their foul shots and missing layups. Korea now works the perimeter once again, finds a man underneath. The pass isn't quite there. Out of bounds. Korea ball. Substitution, Korea. Number 17, Yoon Kichan is in. 194 centimeter forward for Korea. Korea inbounds under the basket. 315 left, third quarter. Drives in for an attempted layup and falls in. And that was Kim Minkyu, number 23 for Korea. Opening up the lead even further. Mike Yoon drives in, puts the layup up, but misses. We're seeing too much of that from Sydney, missing their layups as they drive into the basket. 
Korea now, they drive in. But they're making their layups. Sydney now at the top of the key, but there's a foul. And that was zero, number zero, Lee Gyunhee with the foul. Three forty twenty three point lead by Korea. Two thirty six left in the third quarter. Second shot, good. So Mitch Smith makes his foul shots. They need to uh, keep doing that. Korea now working the ball, and they're doing that so well, working the ball around the perimeter until somebody's able to drive into the lane for a layup. Three point attempt is off the rim. Sydney tries to bring it down quickly. You and Moore passing it back and forth. Luke Yoon. Moore misses the uh, the pass and there's a foul as Korea brings it down. So now Kim Minkyu will take the uh, two shot fouls. And now a substitution for Sydney. Kieran Siba comes in for Sydney, number three. First shot. Falls in. Kim Minkyu makes his first shot, increasing the lead 64 to 41. Two minutes left in the third quarter. Second shot. And he makes it in for a 65-41 lead. Sydney tries to break it in. It's almost stolen. Wide open underneath is number three, Karen Shiba. All alone under the basket. Makes the layup. Korea brings it back down under pressure by Sydney. Working it around the per perimeter quickly. Sydney's uh, having a tough time trying to keep up with the passes. Drives in for a layup. And he's fouled. And that was uh, Johnny Woodcock uh, with the foul. 14th foul. And the Korean player is okay. He took a spell, hit it pretty hard, hit the floor pretty hard, but he's okay. Two shot foul. And that's Lee Gyunhee taking a foul shot. First shot, good. And that's definitely another big difference that we're seeing with Korea making a lot of their foul shots. And Sydney missing their layups. Off the rim, Sydney gets the rebound, brings it down quickly, three on two. Korea gets back. Sydney trying to quicken the pace and drives in. Forces the shot, but it drops. And that's Alexander Sidhu with a uh, two point force layup that drops in for Sydney. Korea now gets the ball, working the perimeter once again. 3 2 offense. Drives in for a layup off the rim, but Korea gets the rebound, works it back out. Hey, then battle for the ball. Korea retains position. Ball hit out of bounds by Sydney. Inbound play. Passes it off, gets it inbound. Pat Jonwa, playmaker, trying to find the open man. On the shot clock, misses. 
He didn't get the shot off before the time clock expired. And we're adjusting the uh, game clock. Sydney will inbound with 53 seconds left. 21 point lead by Korea. Mike Yoon trying to bring it down quickly. Drives in, tries to force a shot up, blocked by Korea. Comes down one on one, and he lays up for an easy fast break two points. 68-45, 33 seconds left. Korea in the lead with a nice margin at the end of the third quarter. And that's Robbie Mura with a layup for Sydney. Two points, 18 seconds left. Last shot of the uh, quarter. Korea slows it down. 10 seconds. Man inside, wide open for two points. Wow. And that was number 13, Pak Jonyeon, with two points. Find himself wide open under the basket. And that's it for the third quarter. Wow. Korea 70, Sydney 47. So Korea is definitely running away with it. And uh, we'll see if Sydney can try to bounce back. Still the whole fourth quarter to come up. So, uh, yeah, they need to uh, just kind of resettle themselves, figure out what's working, what's not. They're getting inside, but they're not making those layups once they get free inside and get those passes. So if they can get that going, they might have a chance. Uh, still, with uh, the top scorer, Korea gets the ball inbound. And now they're looking at uh, top of the key. Back to the top of the key from the baseline. And nice pass inside, but he's heavily guarded by two uh, Sydney defenses, defenders. And they kick the ball out of bounds, so Sydney gets the ball. Korea 70, Sydney 49, 8.35 left in the game. And Sydney brings it down. Robbie Moore bringing it down court. Drives, tries to drive all the way to the basket, misses the layup. Korea now, back to their perimeter game. Waiting for somebody to break into the lane off the screen. Three point shot by Korea is good. And that's Kim Doan with a three pointer with Korea as they pull away with eight minutes left in the fourth quarter. And it's a drive in by Sydney and Josh Payne is fouled as he tries to drive into for a basket, but he's fouled. And that was Kim Minkyu with the foul on Josh Payne. Eight minutes left in the first game. Korea with a commanding lead, 73, Sydney 49. And now Josh Payne lines up for a foul shot. Two shot foul. First shot bounces off the rim, no good. Second shot coming up. And that also in and out of the basket. Now Korea ball, they bring it down court. And they find a player who drove in as number 17, Yoon ki -chan, but they lose it on the pass. Three-point attempt by Sydney, off the rim. They get the rebound, Mikey Young, three-pointer. And it's good, Mikey Young with a three-point shot. Korea 73, Sydney 49. Time out as they uh, wipe the floor. And we have a substitution for Korea. Korea inbounds. And Sydney trying to put on some pressure at half court line. Finds a man open inside. Sydney knocks it out of his hand. 
Gets the ball back. Mike Ian quickly bringing it down court. Top of the key, open man for a three pointer, and that is good. And that was uh, Kiran Chiba with a three pointer for Sydney. Korea 73, Sydney 55, 7 10 left in the game. And Mitch Smith comes in as a substitution for Sydney. And now Korea inbounds. Sydney given full court pressure. Maybe a little bit too late for that. And finds an open man inside and there's a foul. No foul, no foul. That might have been some traveling. Sydney inbounds. Goes to number 12, Matthew Wacha. Isolated, drives in. So that seemed like a foul before the shot, so he's got a two shot foul. So it's a one shot foul, so the points did count as he uh, was fouled laying it up into the basket. 73 57 Korea in the lead with a big lead right now with 642 left in the game. Korea passes it around the perimeter once again. They've just been working for them all night long. Pass it around the perimeter until they get a man open to drive in. Korea gets the rebound underneath, fights for it, passes it out to an open man in the perimeter. Shot clock down to six. Three point attempt is good. Oh, he was uh, just inside the line, so that's a two uh, two point shot. Once again, that was Kim Minku working right off the line. 75 57, 603 left. Korea once again drives in for a layup. And we have a man down, he's grabbing his leg. Korea 77, Sydney 57, 553 left in the game. And we have a man down, it looks like he's got a cramp on his leg. The entire Korean coaching and team uh, has gone down to make sure he's okay. It looked like a leg cramp, but he's up and uh, able to walk, walk off on his own two feet, so he should be okay once the crap uh, subsides. Okay, a quick break for uh, an injury, and now we're back to the game. 5.53 left in the game. Korea 77, Sydney 57, and Sydney will inbound the ball. And uh, the referees made sure that the substitution was uh, properly checked in. That's uh, happened now, so now back to the game. That's Robbie Moore trying to bring it down quickly and success with a two point layup. Korea now bringing it back down. And a steal by Mike Yoon of Sydney. Tries to bring it in himself, finds an open man underneath, passes it off, misses the layup. Sydney retains position, three point attempt off the rim. Missed layup and missed three point by Sydney. And that's kind of been happening all night long. That's why they're down by so much. And a layup by Korea, 79-59. Back to a 20-point lead. Five minutes left in the game. 
And Matthew Waka is fouled as he tries to drive in, puts the shot up, but doesn't fall in. And the center, Campbell Green, number 21, is back in for Sydney. And Sydney will inbound. Robbie Moore doing the honors, passes it off to Wacha. Back to Moore. Tries to drive it inside, finds an open man outside. Now to watch at the top of the key. Turn around jumper off the rim. Loose ball. They're fighting for it. Jump ball. It's not a jump ball. They're uh, giving the possession to Korea. Number 24, Moon Yohel, inbounds it. Finds an open man close to midcourt. Passes it back to him. Crosses midcourt. Korea now. Double team. Finds an open man on the sideline, on the baseline. Three-point shot missed off the rim. And off the hands of Korea, Sydney gets the ball with 4.35 left in the game. 20-point lead by Korea. Sydney inbound, 4.33 left in the game. Robbie Moore trying to bring it down quickly. And we have a foul. And that was a foul by Kim Minkyu, number 23 of Korea. And watch out, we'll get a two shot foul as they uh, clean up the uh, baseline on the court. And now, two shot foul, Matthew, watch out. Second shot, off the rim. So just uh, one shot success in the foul there. 79-60, Korea in the lead. About four minutes left in the game. Korea working it around. Into the paint, and then there's a uh, foul line shot that falls in for two points for Korea. And that was Kim Minkyu, number 23 for Korea with the two-pointer. Sydney now trying to work it in. Behind the uh, back dribble, misses the layup, and popped in by number 14, Mitch Smith. Coming up on the final three minutes. Thrown out of bounds. So Korea will now inbound. Sydney given uh, full court pressure. Sydney crosses the midline. Korea now working the perimeter. And Sydney steals the ball. Long pass to number 14 who goes in for a layup, Mitch Smith. Korea now brings the ball back. And working it around the perimeter. Sydney's having difficulty really keeping up with the passes. Drives in, attempt to lay up off the rim. Mike Ying brings it down to Wacha. Drives in under the baseline. He's fouled, misses the layup. Foul by number 23, Kim Minkyu with his third foul. Well, Sydney has cut the lead down to 17, 16 now. Uh, 65, Sydney, 81, Korea, 254 left in the game. Awesome. 
And the shot bounces off the rim. Sydney fights for the rebound. Korea gets the ball, bringing it down quickly. Open man in the baseline, takes a three-point shot. It's off the rim, no good. Korea gets the rebound, works it back out. Once again, in and out of the basket on the three-point attempt by Korea. Sydney gets the rebound, Matthew Watcha bringing it down court. To the perimeter, shot by Mikey Jung that falls short, goes out of bounds. Korea ball. Korea with a comfortable 16 point lead, 225 left in the game. Substitution, Kieran Siva, number three, comes in for Sydney. Mikey Jung takes a break. And he played a great game. Once again, the uh, pace setter, the playmaker for Sydney, number seven, Mikey Young. Korea inbounds under some pressure. Bad pass. Sydney steals the ball. Three point attempt. Off the backboard, no good. Korea brings it down. Oh. So that looked like an offensive foul. Number 18, Lin Dungan. Sydney has a player down. Looks like his uh, leg is hurting him a little bit. Number 14, Mitch Smith. He's trying to walk it off, loosen it up as uh, we uh, clean up the uh, under the ba basket. And Sydney will inbound. 2.08 left in the game. Game number one deciding the seventh and eighth place teams. Korea University versus Sydney. Sydney brings it down. Three-point shot off the rim. Korea now brings it back down quickly. But Sydney comes back to set up the defense. Bounce pass misses, goes to Campbell Green, passes off. Sydney for a three-point attempt. That bounces off the rim by Kieran Shiva. Foul on the play. So with 146 left in the game, that's about all Sydney can do is just bring it down court and try to pop in some three points, but they're being disliked by the basket, hitting off the rim, in and out, or just missing it and hitting off the backboard. And Republic uh, uh, Korea now will inbound. Sydney putting pressure on. Republic uh, Korea gets it on their side of the court, working it around the perimeter. perimeter. Baseline three-point jumper, good, wide open. Eighty-four, sixty-five, back to a nineteen-point lead, and Robbie Moore makes a two-pointer. One sixteen left in the game. Korea drives it down, misses the uh, two-point shot. Sydney now bring it back down. Matthew Weka, it's foul. Okay, and Watcher will have a two-shot foul. 107 left in the game. First shot good. Korea 84, Sydney 68. One more foul shot left. He puts it up, and it's good. So Watcher is starting to uh, rack up some points, but a little bit too late. Korea brings the ball down. And Sydney knocks it out. Korea now under a lot of pressure, obviously, by Sydney. Foul. 
And so uh, Henry Anderson fouls out. And number eight, Alexander Sidhu comes in, replacing Henry Anderson, who fouled out. Battle for the ball. Sidney brings it down. Fast break. Misses the layup. Once again, we've been seeing way too much of that by Sidney. They've got to make those layups. And Korea now just slowing it down with uh, 30 seconds left in the game. Top of the key. Still working the perimeter so well. They've been doing it all day long. And the ball goes out of bounds. Ball goes to Sydney. <laughs> working the uh, ball around the perimeter. 11 seconds left. Puts the shot up off the backboard. Korea brings it down for the final shot of the game. And that's it for game number one. Korea 84, Sydney 69. So Korea will be the seventh place team, Sydney in eighth place. So that's game number one for the day. This is uh, the day of the finals. Next stop will be Tokai University versus Pernabas Institute of Indonesia. Uh, Tokai from Japan, obviously, and that will be for the fifth and sixth place finishers. Game number three will be Radford University from the United States versus Ateneo de Manila of the Philippines. They have been playing some really good basketball. That's gonna be a great game for the third and fourth place finishes. And then uh, game number four, the final, NCCU. Chinese Taipei versus Hakuo University. That's gonna be an exciting game as well. So that's it for the first game. This is our final day of uh, competition. World University Basketball Series 2023, brought to you by San Cloretta. So, Yoyogi National Gymnasium number two. We just finished game number one. As the uh, players uh, say their thank yous to the court and to the audiences. And uh, we're going to be back uh, very shortly for game number two. Tokai University versus Perbanas Institute. And both of those teams have been playing some very, very good basketball. So that's going to be a great game. Uh, my partner Matthew will be here to host the game. So please stay with us. All day long, some exciting basketball. Come down and see us. We'd love to see you here. I'm DJ John. I'll be back for game number three. Once again, thanks for joining us. And uh, yes, exciting World University Basketball Series 2023. Don't go away. We'll be back. Stay with us. Thank you.